All right, burger lovers in Colorado are rejoicing today after In-N-Out Burger announced plans to open up shop in our state. A burger chain with a cult following is coming to Colorado Springs with plans to expand along the front range. This has been a hot topic around the state today. Our Jeff Todd, one of those <laughs> fanatics. Jeff, we have both spent time in California, but we have some very different opinions on this. Yeah, Dominic, there are plenty of people like you who just don't think it's very good or don't really understand the following. Then there's people like me with hats. We've got shirts. You know what I even have right here in my fridge? The secret spread. In and out, in and out. I've been in love with In-N-Out Burgers for 20 years. I was even surprised at my wedding here in Colorado with a plate of double doubles from my best man. We've been bootlegging burgers from California over the Rockies since 2005. I grew up like across the street from the original one. Paul Neiman's been doing the same since the late 80s. I always ordered 12 burgers, bring them back in two bags on the plane, bring them back home for everybody to reassemble them. Paul lives in Aurora. It's a towel. And has extensive in and out memorabilia. I always sport at one of these on the back of my Ford Fiesta. I never thought this day would come. I just right. never thought they would come here. Right, right. No, I've heard that too today. I'm pretty excited about it now, so I'm, I'm real excited. Everyone is ready with their order. Two hamburgers, grilled onions, extra spread, fries light, one minute 30, and large Coke. That's my drill. It is not overrated. It is the best burger around. Four by four, animal style, no pickles. Andy Klein is the man that made in and out in Colorado a reality. A distribution center and first store will be built in Colorado Springs with more stores on the horizon. I think that uh, was actually a big selling point, the fact that we've been In-N-Out Burger fans for years and years. Well, I'm all happy for In-N-Out to be here, you know. I'm all behind them. It's good eats for us now. Now, we weren't given a timeline for when this store distribution center will be open, but that's the key here, a distribution center. That means that it's very likely we're going to see plenty of these yellow arrows all over Colorado. Reporting live, Jeff Todd covering Colorado first. We can agree to disagree, but I, I appreciate your pride, Jeff. Thanks. <laughs>